After driving the car, I can only smile. The vehicle is a really enjoyable vehicle to drive and a very compelling package. As you can see, dimensionally, the vehicle is as long as a Corolla sedan, but 185 millimeters taller. In the Toyota SUV family, the Corolla Cross will slot in below the RAV4 and above the CHR. And without giving too much away prior to the launch, the Corolla Cross boasts plenty of soft touch surfaces. And depending on which model you choose, is a wash with leather finishes as well. One of the features that I particularly enjoy is the floating eight inch infotainment system. Also true to its SUV roots is the raised seating position, which gives a really commanding view of the road and provides plenty of headroom, which is a particular plus in this vehicle. Also the versatility of the 6040 rear split seat and the class leading luggage space. I must confess though, and here's where the engineer and me comes out. The two things I'm most excited about are the TNGA platform, which really makes the Corolla Cross a driver's car, and the hybrid drivetrain, which is really a key step towards zero emission driving. From a production perspective, it also means a number of firsts for our plant here in perspective. The Corolla Cross is the first platform locally produced vehicle to use the TNGA architecture. And in this instance, the C platform is also the one that underpins the CHR, the Corolla sedan, and the Corolla hatch. One of the main benefits of the TNGA C platform is a low center of gravity, which directly benefits uh, the balanced feeling of handling. It's a more engaged drive, and I can really attest to this. And there's a lot less body roll, which is often experienced with the taller SUV models. I can honestly say that you really feel a strong sense of connection between the steering and the car, thanks to the lower seating position. On top of this, you also have the inherent high rigidity of the TNGA platform. 65% more rigid than Toyota's previous C-segment platform. So this car really has an incredibly firm feeling on the road. As far as performance goes, I'm very pleased with the hybrid drivetrain. It's one of the options available on the Corolla Cross, and I'm sure it's one that will resonate with many South Africans and finally bring hybrid into the mainstream. As you know, Lexus and Toyota are leaders in hybrid technology in South Africa, and Lexus already accounts for the most hybrids sold in the country. And the Corolla Cross Hybrid is going to make hybrid accessible to a lot more people. I'm confident that the driving experience is one that our customers are really going to enjoy.